Hi all. I I was I don't even know what day it is. Oh, Thursday. Happy Thursday. Um so it's kind of a a bittersweet Thursday, you know. Um those of us that got a call today that the layoffs are are happening in our world of work and as it has been happening to so many of us out there. Um you know when, and this is going to maybe sound a little bit bizarre, but it was almost, uh, I almost had like a sigh of relief. Because you know when you're waiting for something bad to happen, all signs point to the fact that something bad's going to happen. You, you, you know something bad's going to happen. And it just, it just, you're, you just, it's like you're, you're on this edge waiting, waiting for the confirmation that in fact there is going to be something bad happen. So I feel like it's been like that for a month, over a month. So getting that confirmation that this is it kind of was like, a, okay, now I can start moving to the next step. The next step of planning, the next step of budgeting, because being laid off is clearly, you know, financially different than what you're used to. And, um, yeah, I, budgeting is no new, no new thing for me. I think I've been making something out of nothing since I, like, since I was knee high to a grasshopper. I've never had money. I've not come from money. Um... It's not like, you know, the pool isn't going to get serviced. There is none. There is a $20 Walmart pink pool in an, in my sh shed that uh, the dog quite enjoys being in in the summer that she's looking forward to because that's still happening. Don't worry. The pool guy, that's me, will be filling that up for her when it gets nicer out. Um, so, yeah. So, to me, the budget thing kind of always have done it. So I'll just do it a little bit more. Um, so there's, I'm not going to complain because I, I know for a fact there are people that are majorly struggling and, uh, and, uh, and don't have, you know, the basic stuff that, that one needs. So I'm 100% full of gratitude that I have those things and I will just, we'll just soldier on. That's what we do. We'll all just soldier on, soldier on and stay home. Um, so yesterday I, I have this little coffee table display thing that I love and I always change the theme and I changed it to a Wizard of Oz theme. So there really isn't. So let's just stay there. Also, one of my Wizard of Oz things that I love and, uh, you know, I'm going to click the heels for you and you can feel free to do yourself a wish. But it says, click your heels together three times and make a wish. So I'm going to do it three times. So go ahead out there and make a wish. Ready? Make your wish. So today I'm going to go back to Mr. Uh, von Beethoven and play a little ode to joy because I would like to have some joy. And it is really beautiful outside where I'm from today. It is, I think, going to be 16. So um, that's awesome. And I think my allergies are kind of lifting because I've had the window open and I have not wanted to take my eyeballs out of my head and scratch them. Good sign. Also, I uh, washed my hair last night and wrapped it in a silk and the curls are pretty, pretty rad today. They will not last. This will not last. This is probably going to be over around 5 or 6 p.m. So... Enjoy it while you can, people. Okay, so, ready? Let's rock and roll.
Pretty soon I will be taming wild snakes out of baskets. They'll be dancing for me. I'll be so hypnotic with this thing. That's not, that's not gonna happen. I like snakes. So it's not because I don't like snakes, but I just don't see myself becoming hypnotic with this thing. But the power of yet, I don't see myself becoming hypnotic to snakes yet. Have a great Thursday. I got chili on the, st on the stove, so I took some leftovers because we've driven into leftover town. This is about the time of the week where leftover town is where we go. <coughs> so I put some chili in the, um, in the pot, like at like 5.15 in the morning from the freezer, and it is just getting perfect right now. And I'm gonna serve it in a con carny kind of way with some rice. So, I don't know. I'll catch you guys on Friday.